Hey guys and welcome into the Raxi Report. You're probably wondering why you're on the floor right now. Well, you're not on the floor, you're on a table. Now you're in the sky. <laughs> That's how gravity works. Um, hi. Blabber vlog time. I think we need blabber vlog. Yeah, it's blabber vlog time. I've, uh, I've got this long list. Of struggles and issues and crap. It's it's an imaginary list. It's a it's a hypothetical list, which I keep in my pants, and I don't I don't keep it in my pants. <laughs> but on this list are many different struggles. Anxiety, depression. memories, loss um, a lot of struggles regrets as human beings I think we have so many of these um, bullet points I um I'm, I find it hard to talk to anyone. I find it hard to talk to anyone because I'm absolutely useless and I feel like my anxiety gets the best of me. So if there's ever a situation where you're like, hey, do you want to chat? Do you want to talk? Do you want to hang out? Do you want to... No. And I don't want that to sound like I don't like you or I don't get on with you. It's because I physically can't. I struggle so hard with acting on socialising. I, uh, I get anxiety ridden so much. And it's a giant issue. And I, I, I'm thankful of... I'm thankful of this experience we have here because at least on here I'm able to talk to you and you're, you listen. You listen to all these stupid things that I say and it's like commitment is hard and um, committing to something is very difficult. It's like I, I can't I struggle with dating as well, as I've mentioned before, I struggle with that, just because I, I can't, if I like someone, I can't just come out and say, hey, I like you, because I've done it before, and I've, I've lost someone incredibly close to me, and that knocks you so hard, that knocks you so far back, that it's, it's, um, damaging to your self-esteem it's damaging to your to your um your life um it's just hard I read a lot of comments from you the viewer that say that I'm the most real YouTuber that they've seen and that I speak from the heart and I'm just me. I'm no one special. I'm just me. I'm just saying what others won't. And if what I say can be a um a good thing for people if they can take these words and maybe use them in their own lives and i've done what i've set out to do i suppose i've i've done it game over mission complete <laughs> i've beat the final boss so i had a load of amazing comments on the last video i did which was the random channel trailer slash funny comedy video thing I don't even know what it was it was a 
kind of a thing at the moment. I was like, I want to, I want to make something stupid. So I literally got my brother to just film me walking around the house, and it was one take. It was, it was one just continuous ten minute video that we cut down, and we just took the funniest bits from it. Um, but that's what I do. I just, I get into those moods where I'm just like, I have to do something stupid. <laughs> And I wanted to share it with you because I think there's so much crap and drama on YouTube that we need to laugh. So, that's that. But anyway, I'm going to get my reading glasses, my librarian glasses, and we're going to read this together. Does that work? Yeah, that works. Okay. I'm going to pull this out. Oh, God. You hate it when you have glasses and you have the hair stuck down the side. Anyway. Oh. Uh, um, so Hannah says, your whole family must have a gene for fantastic hair. Thank you. No, I, I do. It's, it's quite thick. It used to be really thin. I actually was, um, before I even started transitioning, uh, when I was in secondary school, my, actually, my hair started to fall out in like clumps. I'm not even kidding. It was the scariest time of my life. I think it was due to stress. My hair was really thin for a long time. And since I've started taking hormones, it's thick and dry out again. Because originally it was. My dad's hair is very thick. He hasn't done anything to his hair apart from colour it. So, um, Chloe's transformation says, Oh, I forgot to tell you. I first came across your channel when you did a reaction video of Chloe Silence. <laughs> Chloe freaking Silence. Oh my God, that guy. I... God, that guy. Um, <laughs> yeah. Uh, Chloe Silence. That's a whole, that's a whole other ball of, ball of games. That is. Um, <laughs> um, I saw this right when I was feeling really upset and lonely. This is so hilarious. I can't stop laughing. I'm feeling a little better now. Thanks. By the way, your yard is huge. Uh, we worked out that we could fit three of our houses in that yard before we had the extension put on the house. So it is pretty big. It's crazy. Um, but yeah, I, I, I'm glad. I, I, I this That was part of the aim of the video was to make just people laugh and smile and... I'm glad that you enjoyed it and it helped. Um, Millie says, You always cheer me up when I'm having the worst time. You are the most real YouTuber I've found. Thank you for being you. Thank you for watching. And I'm again, I'm glad it helped. Um, uh, King Woody 911 says, uh, Just wondering, how Roxy, how tall are you? Uh, I am six foot three and a bit. Maybe six foot four. Yeah, I'm like one of those really tall runway models, you know? One of those ones that doesn't need stilettos. <laughs> because if they wore stilettos, their head would hit the roof. Um, <laughs> Joanna Elvie says, At first I thought you had been drinking. I, I, I was drinking. No, I wasn't drinking. Ah, uh, then I realised you were just being Roxy. So true. So true. Uh, Kelfi says, um, I regained consciousness. Uh, when I regained consciousness, I continued laughing. It's great to see Banana has made a cameo in this comedy short. It might also make a cameo in the movie too. Hopefully, unlike some comedy teams, you two don't go your separate ways over creative differences. Like the Everly Brothers went on, on their own separate way. I hope not. I have to live with him, so hopefully not. Um, Will, <laughs> Will says there are no words. So true. Uh, Megzi says, best way to start my day here in Australia. Love you, chick. Keep it coming. Thank you. Um, I, I will, I, as I said before, I'm probably going to do another one soon. Uh, Hannah says, there isn't a mean bone in your body. Um, no, I get, I actually cried when I stepped on a snail a couple of days ago. I'm not even joking. Um, also, Battlefield 1, I played that. The story, I cried four times. I have literally the most emotional emotions right now. Uh, Francis Mastery says, I love you. I love you too. Uh, Nicole says, Roxy, I adore you so much. I love your videos, lady. Well, I love your videos too. And thank you for watching. And keep and just stay awesome. I'll send some subscribers your way. Uh, but please don't hit them, says Grumhart. I'll try not to. It depends. Depends how I'm feeling, if I'm in a mood, maybe. 
At Lithical Icicle says, send me some more people your way, Roxy. You must hit 1,000 subscribers. Well, we got five or six, I think, from that video, so we're almost there. Just 195 or something. Uh, <laughs> and Stop Homophobia, which is an amazing Twitter page slash face Facebook page. That basically is helping our community in stopping homophobia by sharing amazing posts on Twitter. Go check them out. I'll leave a link in the description below. Says, do more. And the girl says, she so should. <laughs> Thank you, Nicole. <laughs> I will. Let's do this. Oh, my God. Anyway, um, I want to read one more out. Because this one, this one actually uh, made me kind of go, what? Why? In a good way, not in a bad way. Um, Olivia Grace, on my uh, self-confidence video, said this was probably one of my favourite videos of yours, Roxy. I completely know how you feel when you say you pass from the front, but not from the side. I have the exact same problem, and like you said, it's probably all in our heads. I, I'm glad that my videos recently people have been loving, and I'm just... I don't know what I'm doing differently. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe is, is it because I'm holding the camera now as opposed to having on a tripod? That's it. That's the secret to YouTube. Um, <laughs> I don't know. Um, but yeah, it's it's all in our heads. But our heads are crazy places where where um, weird stuff happens and. The mind is an incredibly annoying thing at times. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Thank you all so much for commenting, for the love, the support. You are my therapist, um, my psychiatrist, and I love you all. But anyway, thanks for watching, but until next time, that's me. Out. Bye, guys.